self-driving car. It's basically a Tesla. Don't even have to touch the wheel. Today we are in Seattle. We're here with Andrew Wilbur. I lived with him in Lebanon for a year, actually. Yes, roommates. Actually, oh, should I mention your channel? Andrew's got a channel where he reviews uh, animal, safe animal uh, catching things. Most, uh, it's broader than that. It's like patio, lawn, and garden supplies. Okay. How to use them. But he's made, he, probably one of your most famous videos was the salt, assault, the salt gun that kills bug, bug, bug assault. Not yeah. to be confused with assault. It's not, okay, bug not an assault <laughs> weapon. It's a bug assault gun. So we're going to meet our friend Anna Medeiros. She was also in Lebanon. We're having a little Lebanon reunion here with some friends of ours. Basically, we're going to get one of these cars, or we're going to get, yeah, we're going to use a car that's a part of Lime Bike, which is a bike sharing app. And also scooters in some cities. Also scooters in some cities. And it turns out, cars, too. That's exactly right. So, we're gonna see if this actually works. I did have to register my license earlier, um, but all that, all that was was taking a picture of it with the app, with the barcode, scanning it, and then uh, it did a little check on me. And they were like, nope, criminal. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna go check it out now, see if this actually works. We'll tell you how much it costs, and if it's worth it, because we don't have a car here in Seattle right now. Here we go. See right there between those two blue cars. You see that, Andrew? I, I see a car between those two blue cars. Let's see this thing. Okay, that's the car. We found the car. We found the car. Do you know what Fiat stands for? Uh, scan to drive. I saw one drive by yesterday when we were sitting on the porch. This is cool. Insurance included. That's nice. Free street parking. Unlocking. Oh, okay. It unlocked. It unlocked. Yeah? Especially the cute size. You know what? This would be the perfect size yeah. if we bought a car in Korea. Crazy. Alright, we're in our little pod. Okay. No worries. Oh, Ooh, and it's not sunroof. Wow, okay. this is a fancy. Yeah. They have a little charging wow, thing too. Amazing. Oh, of course. Oh. It works. Amazing. Charger works so Check far. The AC. Let's see if the AC works. AC works. Seatbelt works. Hey, this tells you what all the signs mean. So we need to go to Bellevue. We're visiting a friend there uh, from Lebanon as well, Anna Medeiros. She was in one of our Lebanon vlogs. She gave us a tour. She was in both of our Lebanon yeah, vlogs. Both. She gave us a tour around Lebanon. So. Off you guys. Whoa, the whole car works. Dude, it feels good actually. It's a nice little car. Going left. <laughs> this is like nicer than most cars I drive ever. Okay, so we are now on our way. The car is awesome. This idea is awesome. I can't believe this is real. You should have it everywhere. It should have it everywhere. We're gonna do a quick little space tour of this car slash function tour. Um, but How many miles does it have on it? It's got 2,000, it's got 2,437 miles, which is nothing. That's, so it is very new. We've got a radio, the AC works. Ooh, is this for a, oh, these are good. It's oh, for our windows. Let's see what else. You can pick up phone calls. It's got cruise control, which is awesome. Um, Does it drive itself? Can we just let go of the steering wheel? Whoa! It's driving itself. That's crazy. It's, it's basically a Tesla. You don't even have to touch the wheel. <laughs> it might be a bit of a squeeze, but you can fit five people back here. Maybe five and a half if you're pregnant. I think the final thing that's so crazy 
is that this is basically car rental in the most convenient way possible. We, it's fast, you rent the car like that, and then it's also based on your location, more or less. But I don't have to go downtown to a herd, so I don't have to go down back to the airport. It was literally a five minute walk from my house. And I didn't even know life could be that convenient. Nice We're thinking about driving to Vancouver. <laughs> we don't know if it's a good idea, but it's an idea that's been thrown out. So we'll we'll update you if that happens. <laughs> well, it is 40 cents a minute. So so if you're doing a 15 minute drive, it's going to be a, around 10 to 14 dollars, I assume, depending on how quick you are. Um, which might be a little bit more expensive than an Uber, but if you're just by yourself, you might as well take Uber Pool which would be way cheaper, but if you're a group with people and you need a little bit more flexibility, it totally makes sense to get one of these cars. Absolutely. And uh, the only other charge there was, was a $15 fee when I um, got my license checked, but that $15 gets credited to the app. So I'm not exactly sure why they do it that way, but... So you now have like $15 to yeah. spend basically yeah. before it actually starts charging your Yeah, so overall, I think it's an amazing deal. I can't believe you can just get a car like this for, for I mean, you're de definitely for the convenience, you should almost be paying, paying more probably, um, but it's a very good deal for a short term trip. Otherwise you should probably rent a car if you're going like into different cities or <laughs> hours. Just imagine people like when the internet first started, people were just first dabbling into it and were just like making doing emails or something they probably had no idea that it would be applied into something like this two other really amazing features is you don't have to put gas in it so that's included in those 40 cents a minute and insurance is included as well on the car I assume we didn't look that detailed into it but insurance is some kind of insurance is covered on it and then the last thing is um, well, yeah, there's just no maintenance. You don't have to do any kind of maintenance with this car. Okay, so we arrived, we're gonna park now. So here we go. That's it. Oh, there they are. We did it. All right, so uh, this car was amazing. Um, I can't believe this, this is a real thing. I wish this was in every city. I am gonna end the ride now. The key gets left inside, and um, yeah, every otherwise everything was perfect. The car was perfect, everything was great about it. So just to lock it, we're gonna, you just lock it. Oh, you could pause ride. Lock the vehicle while you grab a coffee. We're just gonna end the ride though. Put headlight switch in off position, put gear shifter in park, roll up windows, put key in off position, close doors and trunk. Remember to take your belongings. We did all that. We've got all our stuff. Got you got your bag. You got your belongings. Bag. And trip. All windows are up. All windows are up. Windows are up. Confirm. Validate proper parking. Car parking 7 a.m. to 6 p.m. except Sunday and holiday. I mean, that other car is parked over there. Okay, I'm giving it five stars. Okay, so we drove about 10 miles, cost about $10. I think it's a really great deal, to be honest. It might have cost that in an Uber, a not Uber pool. And it was really fun to drive. And then lastly, we found our friend Anna. <laughs> the car did its purpose. We got to Anna, the famous the tour guide. Tour, tour guide. guide of, so Love now we're gonna walk to uh, <laughs> find <the> studio. <laughs> All right, that's good. Condo.